Hello, everyone. Sunyan here. Um, I just thought I'd share this cool thing with you guys. I met a friend on Twitter. His name is Rob Chaturvedi. He's, uh, I think, fourth year engineering student in India. He showed me um, this game. And I asked him to put it on GitHub, which he did. So the link is in below. And I would like you guys to follow along and maybe participate and improve the computer AI in this game, which could be a lot of so the computer AI is almost entirely inside this computer turn. Actually, it is inside this computer turn in its entirety. There is a class called cards, which is, you know, your object oriented deck of cards, which is referenced by this program. But what this game does is essentially the computer knows to match suits and numbers and knows to actually right here list all the options that it can play and then play the highest value option so when every time the game is over the loser is left holding some cards and the loser loses by a certain number of points so the lower value of the cards that you hold the better it is so you're gonna win, win some you're gonna lose some um, but the objective of this and the reason I'm sharing it with you is I want you to go to github download this it, try to improve on it and try to make it a more fun game where um, the computer has more and more of an edge. At this point, I can beat the computer in three games out of four. And maybe I'll just play one. So, up card, QC. Well, I can match it with Jack C. 6C. Well, I have to draw a card. Ah, 5C. Oh, no. I have to draw again. The computer drew a card too, so the computer doesn't have any clubs. The computer drew a card, and I still don't have any clubs. There must be a ton of clubs in the deck. Okay, I don't have a five, I don't have a club. This is going bad. Nope, don't have a card, don't have a club. This is the first time that happened actually, so the game's getting ridiculous. Take a card. Still. Okay, I finally have a club. So I can play eight of clubs. And I can change when I play an eight. I can change the suit. And which suit do I have most of? I would say spades. So that's going to be the new suit. Spades. Queen of spades. Now I can play my highest spade. but And at the end I can play the eight of spades. So... I can play nine spades. So I can play six of spades. He played six of hearts. He switched it up on me. Okay, I'll play nine of hearts. I got a lot of hearts. Seven of hearts. I can switch it up to seven of diamonds. Played king. I can go QD. 2D, and I can switch it back to spades, and I think he's gonna struggle, he's got five of spades, okay, I'll play four of spades, and he had to draw a card, and I can play now four of diamonds, and I can play four of hearts, and now I have to draw a card. Five of hearts. Now I have to draw a card again. Computer is doing well, but I can change that to three of clubs. Computer to draw a card. I can make that the ten of clubs. Man, I need a spade. Um, I have to draw a card again. I have to draw a card again. Four clubs, I have to draw again. I have a heart out. So I can change that to two of hearts. Ace of hearts, I got two aces, I can go ace spades. And I can play my eight of spades and change the card to diamonds. 
and play my ace of diamonds and I win. So I got 10 points from the computer's hand. As you can see, the game took a while. It's a fun game to play. And I really think there is value in trying to improve this AI. And what we could do, if you contribute to this, is we could pit our AIs against each other. So anyway, check the game out, play it, see how you go, and see if you can improve on the computer AI. Later.